Hello everyone, Chef Kimberly here with my good friend, Chef David. Hello, Hi. Back. Hi, say hi to everyone. So we're at Purge Costa Mesa today where we just installed the brand new, beautiful 400 series Gaganel steam oven. Today we'll be showcasing a nice fall, um, but you know, holiday inspired, but you could do it all year long uh, menu today. What do we have going on today, Chef David? Um, we have a variety of great things. Uh, first off, we have a, uh, some wonderful vegetables. We have some squash that we'll be doing, uh, also sous vide. And so we have some nice carnival squash here. And then Those we have some acorn squash that are going. Like I love these beautiful colors. Look at that, how beautiful that's gonna look in that vacuum seal. So these are gonna be vacuum sealed as well too. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put it in there. Okay, so I have that going here. Probably won't use all of it. Okay. okay. So with this, what I did ahead of time is I did this beautiful brown butter, which is basically I'm just cooking butter on the stove until you get like this really nice, um, kind of like auburnish color, kind of like my hair, right? Yeah. Like yeah. my hair. <laughs> That's beautiful. a good example. Um, so I did that and I fused it with a little bit of hazelnuts and sage. So I'm gonna go ahead and scoop that in here. This is really nice. You could keep that in your fridge too. You could use it for anything like chicken or other vegetables. I like to always have some brown butter. Some, I do like lemon zest or something in there to give it another flavor. <clears throat> So I have that right there just off to the side. I'm gonna take some shallot. I'm just gonna slice it up a little bit. That little slice. So again, and I feel like when you're doing sous vide, I feel like the flavors get so much more infused into whatever ingredient you're using. They do, they do, because you're cooking at those really low temperatures, you have an opportunity to have those cell walls of whatever it is that you're cooking uh, open up and really accept and just receive all of those flavors that just marry right into your product. And a little um, trick too that we like to do is go ahead and put everything in your vacuum seal the night before. So that alone, that's gonna kind of almost marinate it, right? Correct, correct. Uh, and that's really uh, another really great aspect of uh, the vacuum door as well. It's not just a vacuum door, it, it is a preservation system. Uh, it can be used for canning. You can actually preserve some red wine if you'd like as well. It Ooh, has a variety of- You're talking uh, yeah, my language. Variety here. of benefits. Um, uh, you can freeze as low as a minus 40 degrees and you can cook as high as 212 degrees in these uh, uh, food safe bags as well. So yeah, you have a lot that you can do with this. Right, it's very so versatile. I threw my shallots in there and I have a little bit, uh, it's about two tablespoons of brown sugar. The sugar just makes everything nice. I love that recipe. I'm crying because it's so delicious. We have staff here to the eat. Shallots, it just hit my eye right now. <laughs> I thought my glasses were gonna work as goggles. Okay, so then I'm gonna take some fresh, even though the butter has some sage in, um, infused into it, I wanna take some fresh, kind of just get some slices of this going. I love all these flavors. I love squash, I love squash season. It's one of my favorite. So I got sage, then I got some nice hazelnuts that we're gonna go ahead and chop up and throw in there as well. I know it seems like a, a lot of ingredients, but I'm, trust me, it's so worth it. The flavors that you get, it's gonna be amazing. Oh, so nice. just give it a quick chop, and it's not too small. I just kind of want like big chunk pieces in there. And my dish is pretty much done. So That's we have our nice. squash right there. And once we vacuum Perfect. seal this and then it gets in the oven, the butter is going to be nice and melted. A nice little glaze with the sugar. That's going to be amazing. Yeah. Actually, even those, that, that liquid is just going to be just oh, so Oh yeah, the good. liquid that the squash is going to yeah. be. Yeah, that, that's leaking. just, yeah. Go ahead and put that on the top. Right. And what temperature are we using for this? And so for this, we're gonna go down to a 147. I think that should work. Uh, again, this is one degree accurate. Uh, and we're gonna go, I think we're gonna go 30 because we have that uh, squash in yeah, there. We want it to get nice and, nice and tender. Yeah, and, cause yeah. we're just gonna eat that right out of the bag. Well, not like savages right out of the bag, but we're gonna put it on a nice plate and then eat it, eat it up for a little snack. So, right, so we're gonna let that go. Yep. So it's been about, what, 40 minutes, right? Yeah. And our acorn squash is all ready to go. So we're gonna go ahead and pull that out and start plating. All right, so David, you know, get the door, the door for me like a gentleman, yes. thank you. Yes. <laughs> all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and just pull this tray out. And it's not that hot, but you could use towels, you know, I've burned my hands a few times, so I don't feel a thing anymore. So this is a super easy dish. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and just cut it right open. I'm gonna go ahead and pull out my squash and just lay it on this plate. It's so nice. Look at that color, isn't oh, that beautiful? It's pretty. That's pretty. Just gonna go ahead and, and lay um, them out. And what we'll do is we'll take some of this like extra 
um, shallots in there and just kind of pour it on top. Mmm, smells so good. That brown butter is amazing. Yeah, that smells amazing. It's like yeah. that nutty yeah. fall smell. Oof. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is take a little bit of this and just sprinkle it on top. So I'm just gonna take some of these broccoli sprouts and these I got at a farmer's market too. Gorgeous. I'm just gonna go ahead and put it on top. Can you hold that for me? Yeah, that's kind of need to pull those apart a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Very nice. Okay. And then the light day there. Hey, you go. Beautiful. All right. And then take some pomegranate seeds, give it a nice little bite to it. And just those colors are going to look so pretty against each other. And then that's it. And then you have yourself a little nice uh, side dish or a nice little appetizer to get started with. Um, you Amazing. could also toast some hazelnuts and put that on top of there too. But I think this is just so beautiful. Look at that. I'm going to take a bite of this. Don't mind me. Please do. And notice too how they retain their colors. They Everything do. really retains its colors Everything really beautiful, looks beautifully. Mm, how is that? Mm, that brown butter, that yeah, nutty flavor. The sweetness, salty, the little tanginess of the pomegranate mm -hmm, seeds. Mm -hmm. it's nice all touch. Great combination. Also beautiful, the contrasting colors of the uh, pomegranate mm -hmm. seeds. Really, really beautiful. Mm. Hey, what do you think? How I do? Oh my gosh. It mm. says holidays. It's written all over it. All right. right? <laughs> the fall season is ready. It's, it's like coming out of this plate right here. Look how beautiful that is. That is. super delicious. Mm, Great so recipe. Yeah, I know. I Great job. Yeah. All right, Chef David, thank you for joining me. It's always a pleasure. I always have pleasure. so much fun with Thanks you. Thanks for having me. Thanks, Perch, for having me. It was just <laughs> wonderful. Now, if you want to come on in and see this for yourself, our new Gaganel 400 series, you can come visit Costa Mesa or one of our other showroom locations. We have Glendale, Rancho Mirage, um, San Diego UTC, and one of our new showrooms opening up in Cedros. Um, so please go to perch.com, set an appointment um, so you can meet one of our great associates to help you out with anything you need. Thank you for joining us today. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> go back in. This is one in a series of showcase videos that you can watch on our Perch YouTube channel.